So today I'm gonna to be unboxing a brand new acoustic guitar, which is especially exciting because I haven't played acoustic since 2017. 2018, around that time. So Orangewood from LA have reached out to me and sent me this guitar. I'm just gonna open the guitar and share this experience and excitement with you. So I don't think there's much else to say. Let's just get straight into it. So, here we are. That's a cool hard case. It's, it's just a hard case, but even the handle is really ergonomic and that's gonna last a long while. All right. It actually sounds in tune. We'll see about that. We'll see how good my ears are. Uh, I am glad that it's not like a light wood, like a sand wood kind of thing. It's like a, a tanned softwood. I'll tell you exactly what it is in a moment. Not bad. That's not bad since that came all the way from LA to east coast of Australia where I live. Okay, so this is obviously a grand auditorium with a cutaway. I like a cutaway. I feel like for me, it's just essential in the style that I play. I like to be able to access the upper frets and have a bit more freedom on what I can do. So the top wood is Torrified Solid Sitka spruce. Now torrified or torrification is a way of baking the wood, I believe, which makes the finish very unique. Your finish will be one of a kind, which is kind of cool. The back and sides are solid pow ferro, which actually kind of sounds Hawaiian, but is actually Brazilian, funnily enough. I do know that much. The neck is mahogany and the fretboard is ebony, which I think will complement what I expect to be bright. These are Grover open back tuners. And we've got a ebony bridge, which is also very cool, I think. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna take it upstairs and give it a proper whirl, set up the microphones properly, do some good recording for you to listen to. I'm gonna enjoy playing this for a while before I share my final thoughts with you at the end of the video. If you want to learn more about music theory, songwriting technique, fretboard visualization, and much more, then come and join me on Fretwise. Become a member today and you'll get access to all of my masterclasses, as well as daily challenges, a members forum, and personalized progress reviews. Click the link in the video description or go to getfretwise.com to learn more. Okay, it's a little claustrophobic here. I look a little weird because I'm trying to talk down into the voice mic here, which I'm doubling up as the recording mic. This is the Rode NTG2. It's not really designed for acoustic guitar, but I'm making the best of what I've got. I've also got the Zoom H5 handy recorder, and hopefully those microphones give you a relatively organic sound that reflects what this guitar actually sounds like. Let's have some fun.
I don't think an acoustic demo would be complete without some John Mayer, so let's see how that goes. Okay, I hope you enjoyed some of those examples. I'm gonna wrap up this video by talking about my overall thoughts on the guitar and Orangewood as a brand. And I'm just gonna start there really quickly with the brand because they were very pleasant to deal with. They sent me a text message as soon as the guitar left the warehouse and when it arrived, which was a really cool touch. They obviously emailed me tracking codes and any questions or requests that I had, they were very pleasant to deal with and very reassuring that I was going to receive a high quality product. So I do rate Orangewood as a brand, but of course the most important thing is whether or not the guitar lives up to its price tag. Now this guitar sells for 895 US dollars. That includes worldwide shipping, which is very cool. I do think that for a guitar that's sub $1,000, this is definitely up there amongst the best that you're gonna get. I love the finish, I love the shape, the cutaway is really nice, the fretboard feels fantastic, the finish on the back of the neck is very pleasant. I have played some acoustic guitars before where the back is very glossy and it's just not very fun to navigate around, but this doesn't at all get sticky or clammy. So overall, I really like it. We're gonna have a blast together creating music. So that's all from me today. If you have any questions or comments, drop them in the comment section below. Thanks again to Orangewood for this collaboration and I will see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.